there everyone, Luke Miss Prime here, so it's time for another lovely Super Runs catch from my country today, it's going to be for Verman Wunderbar. No, I have no Wunderbar, how you pronounce it, so yeah. This is a pretty cool looking character, I really love his design, they did a good job making him, look at that, that's very well done. Yeah. So what to do, well he's just all drumming, so I think he's an acrobat. He has a golden gun, yeah. He's the man with a golden gun. <laughs> Forget the pun. <laughs> uh, whoa! Now that's a pretty cool shield. I love that. How he makes like a, a cube around him. Nice. Brilliant. And if I hold A, what happens? <laughs> he rolls. <laughs> okay. Nice. Anything else? Does he will? All oh, right. So when you hover over something, he's gonna open fire instantly. That's pretty good. Now, um, if you're wondering who his voice actor is, guys, um, it is Corey Burton. Yeah, Corey Burton voices quite a few characters in this game. I mean, he's a great voice actor. He's done lots of phenomenal voice work. He's also in the game as Hugo Strange and Kanto, and also as the Rock of Professor Brainiac as well. Who else does he voice in this? Yeah, who else does he voice on the grid? Hmm. Oh yeah, Toy Man. Voice is Toy Man. Can't forget Toy Man. Hmm. Did a good job voicing Vermin, Vermin as well, definitely. And yeah, I must say they did a good job making him, yeah. I mean, because when you think about it, he's never played in, in a logo game before Vermin Wonderbar. So yeah, and I don't think he's he's, he's not an official minifigure either. So yeah, he's um, he's exclusive to this game, exclusive. And uh, if you're wondering, you know, like how to unlock him, um, he's actually a boss character in the Justice League bonus mission, I think. Yeah, so he does appear in the story, but you you can't unlock him. But you can unlock him if you complete the bonus mission where he plays the Justice League. So do that, and then you can unlock him after you buy him from the grid. Yeah, don't know how much he was, but. So uh, now it tells us what you can do in the game with voice and hang on locking. Let's take a look at his character's profile and read it. So as no way less, because his name is being in Wonderbar, and he's going to take on the identity. It's related to the new gods of Apocalypse and Dark Side Elite. So he's he's not quite yeah, he double jumps, yeah. Beam deflect, shield, yeah, we saw a beautiful cube shield. A goo command on ice, that's pretty cool. He has a phone, let's, let's take a selfie. Who'd have thought someone from Pockets would have a phone on him? <laughs> you gonna fall, Smith? Thank you. That's his profile now. Dedicated to carrying out the wishes of Granny Goodness after growing up in her orphanage on Apocalypse, Vim and Vunderbar is one of Darkseid's higher ranking minions. Never hesitating to use a variety of underhanded tactics, Veerman is a cunning strategist and a worthy adversary to any hero. First appeared in Mr. Miracle issue 5 in 1971. Our oh, nice one is going to go up in 2022, we'll be celebrating his uh, 51st anniversary rather than more than 50 years, that's amazing. So this is me showing you Veerman Wunderbar in Legacy Super Runs. So yeah, pretty cool character, good, mem good character, part of the elites of Darkseid, yeah, and a good addition to the game, yeah. Very, very nice for design and voice that's by Picari Burton as well. So uh, be sure to give this video a like. Also let me know in the comments what you think of Vim and Wonderbar. If you play this game, what you think of them in general. Also be sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos coming in the future. And I will see you all later.